Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh. So students, uh, Central Bank of India Credit Officer exam. I hope you have started your preparation for that. And today we are going to discuss the latest banking awareness for month, for the month of November 2023. So thoda sa difference already I have done the class for the banking awareness. But for this particular exam, kuch ek news I have removed and uh, I have added some of the RBI circulars. So important class I'm going to do. especially for the credit officer uh i'm going to cover this the whole class within like 15 20 minutes okay so let's start the session so let me just hide my face so that you can focus on the content hdfc bank appointed uh, the former rbi uh, former nabard chairman as a independent director harsh kumar banwala so kind of important for your exam okay RBI appointed Manoranjan Mishra as executive director so that much is sufficient to remember okay itna hi sufficient rahega yaad rakhne ke liye nothing more than that fully accessible route or route for investment by non residents in government securities what is fully accessible route fully accessible route it is a mechanism introduced by RBI by which the non residents by which the non residents they can invest in government securities they can invest in government securities without any hurdles okay unrestricted it facilitates a unrestricted investment by non residents in the specific government securities now sovereign green bond is that specific government security abhi government jo sovereign green bonds hai usme bhi invest kar sakte hain via fully accessible route to this is this was the notification ki ab isme bhi kar sakte hain theek hai so what are sovereign green bonds sovereign green bonds see uh, whatever the uh, the amount received in green sovereign green bond that money is invested in sustainable development projects so that is sovereign green bonds so it's a debt instrument issued by the government of india to finance environmentally sustainable projects so ye teen cheeze yaad rakhe it is a debt instrument issued by the government of india to finance environmentally sustainable projects theek hai so sovereign green bonds are within the ambit of far or fully accessible route important circular from examination point of view state bank of india and mnm financial services they signed an co lending agreement को लैंडिंग अग्रीमेंट एम एंड एम फाइनेंशियल सर्विसेज दे आर एन एन बी एन बी एफ सी एस बी आई उन्हें पैसा देगा वो आगे लैंड करेंगे इतना ही समझ लीजिए इससे ज़्यादा कुछ जरूरत है नहीं दिस वन इज़ इम्पॉर्टेंट आर बी आई रिलीज नॉन्स फॉर रेगुलेटिंग फिनटेक्स इन क्रॉस बॉर्डर पेमेंट स्पेस फॉर द क्रॉस बॉर्डर एक कंट्री से दूसरी कंट्री में जो पेमेंट्स होती हैं फॉर दैट आर बी आई रिलीज द गाइडलाइंस द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट गाइडलाइन हेयर इज द मिनिमम नेटवर्थ का रिक्वायरमेंट minimum net worth requirement for existing non bank payment aggregator cross border, cross border is 15 crore jo existing hai unke liye 15 crore bhi chahiye and jo new applicants hain uh, they will need a net worth of 25 crores okay and that's all about it uh, itna hi important hai and application deadline for existing payment aggregators 30th of april 2024 for new applicants First of July 2024. Uh, from that particular date, they can apply. Okay. Regulatory measures towards consumer credit and bank credit to NBFCs uh, and commercial banks. Uh, see, students, risk weight for the consumer credit. What is a consumer credit? The personal loans that you are taking from banks. Uska risk weight bada diya. Now the banks they need to have more capital. आई मीन दे नीड टू पुट इन मोर रिस्क वेट रिस्क वेट ज़्यादा लगा रहे हैं इसलिए उन्हें कैपिटल भी ज़्यादा रखना पड़ेगा राइट सो बेसिकली टू अंडरस्टैंड करने के लिए कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट एक्सपोजर फॉर कमर्शियल बैंक ऑफ कमर्शियल बैंक एंड एन बी एफ सीज हैज बिन इंक्रीज बाई ट्वेंटी फाइव बेसिस पॉइंट्स टू वन ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट रिस्क वेट जो है फॉर कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट हैज बिन इंक्रीज टू वन ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट इट यूज टू बी हंड्रेड परसेंट बट इट इज नाउ वन ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट सम एक्सक्लूजन आर देयर हाउसिंग लोन एडुकेशन लोन व्हीकल लोन लोन सिक्योर्ड बाय गोल्ड एंड गोल्ड ज्वेलरी माइक्रो फाइनेंस एंड सेल्फ हेल्प ग्रुप लोन्स इनका वेटेज नहीं बढ़ा है द वेटेज हैज नॉट बीन इंक्रीज ऑन दीज लोन्स बट ऑन कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट एक्सेप्ट हाउसिंग लोन एडुकेशन लोन व्हीकल लोन लोन सिक्योर्ड बाय गोल्ड एंड गोल्ड ज्वेलरी एंड माइक्रो फाइनेंस लोन एंड सेल्फ हेल्प ग्रुप लोन्स रिस्क वेट हैज नॉट बीन इंक्रीज हेयर बट रेस्ट ऑफ द कंज्यूमर क्रेडिट रिस्क वेट हैज बीन इंक्रीज टू वन ट्वेंटी फाइव परसेंट 
and risk weight on credit card receivable on credit card receivable risk weight has been increased by 25% percentage points uh, for the con uh, scheduled commercial bank the risk weight for the credit card receivable the money they are going to receive for uh, from the credit card holders jo bhi due hai that is 150% weightage hai uska for nbfcs it is 125% so please remember 150% for scheduled commercial banks risk weight kitna hai for credit card receivable it is 150% for scheduled commercial banks and 125% for nbfcs the risk weight for bank credit banks are giving credit to nbfcs so it has been increased by 25% it has been increased by 25% uh and also that is uh that is uh, dependent upon the external rating of the nbfc so external rating ye circular ek alag circular hai we have already done that in the past as of now you need to understand ki 25 percentage point jo hai risk weight bad chuka hai for risk weight uh, risk weight uh, for bank credit to nbfcs axis bank and irma uh, they ink the mou to promote financial inclusion and literacy in india for five year period okay irma uh, that's an institution uh, at uh, anand uh, gujarat right itna important hai one year interest rate rate has been announced by the government of india to divyang borrowers okay so which uh, the department of the department of empowerment of person with disability under the ministry of social justice and empowerment they provided this subsidy to the divyang borrowers icic bank they got an uh, approval from rbi to make icic securities its whole uh, wholly owned subsidiary <clears throat> that much is sufficient and rbi tells bajaj finance to stop loans under ecom and insta emi products so bajaj finance they cannot issue these digital loans the ecom and insta emi because the loans the short period loans were given at very high rate of interest choti avdi ke loan bahut high rate of interest par diye ja rahe the acha ui dikha ke 2 mahine 4 mahine ka loan they were being issued at a very high rate of interest they were charging a lot of interest and charges that is why rbi tells the bajaj finance to stop these products and sebi chief uh, uh, madhabi butch uh, introduces irr a platform very important so many times abhi recently bhi hua hai uh the broking platform you buy shares from your blog broking platform you do trading on zero the grow or angel one sometimes these apps they don't work but if you want to sell something if you want to sell or buy if you want to trade but the app is not working you are unable to log in you are unable to place your orders so you lose money because of that you are unable to understand whether your order has been placed it has been uh, placed or not or what has been done for that irr a platform has been released by the sebi so that you can verify your orders your investments everything can be verified you can check the status of your investment on this platform the irr a platform this is the name of the platform investor risk reduction access is the name of the platform investor risk reduction platform the full form of irr very important an adb approved 6.5 million dollar loan to greenway so the first lo loan approved by adb under cidf uh, so the loan to the greenway not that important but still you can remember the headline hsbc and uk export financing they tied up for 100 million pound financing program for to support indian msmes okay and that was pretty short session students i hope you like the today's session i have already done uh, uh, the banking awareness in depth there is a like 25 minute session lot more news are there but for central bank of india credit officer and for bank of maharashtra credit officer this session was very very important i hope you like the today's session and you would love the credit officer classes that are available on bankexamstudy.com in which i am providing video classes quizzes notes uh, doubt clearing sessions test series and interview preparation course everything is part of the course uh, the paid course the link to join the course is available in the description this is my whatsapp number you can drop me a whatsapp message and i'm going to answer you you can join the central bank of india credit officer course and also the bank of maharashtra credit officer course uh, for scale 2 and scale 3 uh, 
uh, link to the courses are available in the description. Please check the description. A list of our successful students, all these students that took our courses in the past and they cracked the respective scale 2, scale 3 level exam, credit officer exams and I'm really, really happy for them. If there is any doubt in your mind, you can ask your doubts and I'm going to answer your doubts. And that's all for today, students. Thank you and have a very nice day. Bye-bye.